The one thing that it's important to always remember in EMS or in healthcare in general is whatever we do, there's a person at the end, okay, whose life might depend on on everything that we've done. So if we've got a you know quality company, quality equipment, our staff are empowered, trained, you know, positive, that has a direct impact on that person at the end of the day. I love the industry, but I really like the people and I really like the sort of the leading and the managing of this industry because it's, it's quite unique, it's quite diverse, it's forever changing and, and that's what I like. I can't do routine. Things need to be different for me all the time and it is in this industry. I often used to go out on the road. I still enjoy it. It's just I think what's happened now is there's been a shift in, in, in like my work. Like I said, I always got into EMS to not be behind the desk, but now I find myself behind the desk almost all, every day, all day. So we're going to make a conscious effort to get out for a, a branch visit, to get out with the, you know, with the team, see, you know, see everyone, just have fun. As you can see, if you look at this branch today, a lot of new people that I've never had the opportunity to meet. I'm no different to anybody here. I'm not special, you know. We're all people, we've all got lives, we've all got, you know, we've all got work to do. So, so why should you at work have this sort of hierarchical type structure where you don't, no, you must bring it down. You know, I've got a job, they've got a job, it's a different job. But at the end of the day, we're saying people, and that's why you know, we made that decision ages ago to, to spend time to get out as often as we can. I mean, it's not a glamorous environment, you know, it is, it's tough. When I was on the road, it's, it's completely different now from clinical practice, but the fundamentals are still the same. And knowing what it was like and knowing what I went through, as a, I was also a basic life support practitioner, then I was intermediate. So after going through it, I understand how complex it is, how tough it can be. I think as a, as a team, we're really trying to make sure that the, the guys are as comfortable on the ground as possible, that they've got the best equipment, that they, every day they're able to go and do their best in terms of patient care because that's ultimately why you become you know and why you join EMS it's around service it's around the patient care so that's what drives myself and 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 the team is how how do we specifically in the ops environment how do we just continue to make it a great place to work <laughs>